Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. So here we're at my second video on this channel and today we've got something quite different than the first one which is just an intro and if you haven't seen that make sure you check it out. So this is technically the first real video on this channel and today we are going to be going over my brand new guitar I just got which might be the greatest cheap guitar of all time. So as you see by the thumbnail and title, there is our new guitar. So this is our new guitar. It looks a little red on camera, but it's actually really like hot pink. I know they describe it red on the website, but I literally just got this guitar 10 minutes ago. It was an early Christmas present for my girlfriend, Courtney. Thank you so much, I love you. This is the Kramer Beretta Special. Online, this guitar sells for about $179, and I've been wanting one for a long time, and my girlfriend clearly knew I wanted it. That's why she got it for me. And she just couldn't wait to give it to me, so she gave it to me super early. I'm not gonna lie, I have played it already, and this thing is amazing, especially for the price. And I titled this video, The Greatest Cheap Guitar of All Time, because to be honest, it might be. I know I've seen so many cheap guitars, I've owned so many cheap guitars, and it's been an ongoing discussion what's the perfect first starter guitar and stuff like that. And to be honest with you, this might be it. It gives you a lot of options for such a cheap price, but it's also a great guitar. This guitar is $179, but it's worth a lot more than $179 in terms of sound and quality and stuff like that. All right, so I got it plugged in. We are gonna do a demo and stuff with this today, but just a quick rundown on this guitar. Single pickup, as you see in here. From what I've heard, it's an Alnico 5, and I've already played this already. I know it sounds great. Basic, you know, Strat style tailpiece here. Nothing crazy. Hockey stick headstock, classic Kramer style, as you can see there. And I love that vintage Kramer logo. I think they used that a lot on, no, they didn't. I was gonna say the pointier ones, but this is one they used on this headstock. And then the Kramer Beretta special trust rod cover. So I am gonna go over the hardware and stuff first. One thing off the bat I will say is the volume pot. I've seen this on a lot of them, they, it's not good. But to be honest with this guitar, it's max or nothing for me, because this is just a shred guitar. Uh, this guitar will be my chuggier guitar. Right now it seems to be set up for standard tuning, but I will probably have it in drop C sharp or something like that. Keep in mind, by the way, guys, this is fresh out of the box. It needs a setup. Like there is some fret buzz. It's set up decently, not gonna lie, from out of the box, but it does need a proper setup. So keep that in mind with the sound and stuff like that and the playability. The tuning heads, cheap, obviously, it's 179 bucks, but they actually work pretty well. I've played this guitar decently um, already, and it seems to be staying in tune, especially with brand new strings. So it's gonna be able to tell, I'm gonna be able to tell more over time, but as of right now, it actually works pretty well. And surprisingly, the whammy bar tremolo system stays in tune. I mean, with this kind of guitar, I'm gonna be doing more, doing more of like random sounds like, like that, not really. Like, but I mean, it can do both those and it stays in tune pretty well so far. So I guess let's start jamming out a little bit here. So I am starting off playing in a classic guitar amp with a compressor on. So this is no, pretty much no gain really. So yeah, that's the clean tone. I mean, and another demonstration here, as you can see, is volume. Same, 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 off. So I will be switching that pot out, um, but that's no big deal, really. And honestly, that's probably the only complaint I really have about it is that it's not even a complaint for me because with this guitar, it's just pure full volume rock. Another quick note on this is that the fret job is literally perfect. 
I have seen a bunch of videos on this guitar saying how the fret jobs on this are actually amazing on every single one. And that's not wrong. It's not just people who happen to get good ones. My fret job is absolutely perfect. As you can see there up close, you know, you might not be able to see it very well, but you can just take my word for it. The fret job on this thing is actually amazing. That's another thing too, is like I have this on zero. You can still hear it. I mean, it doesn't say zero, it only says one, so technically maybe it is on just one. All right, so let's switch up the amps here. Let's go 6505 in the memory of EVH himself, rest in peace, Eddie. <laughs> See, and that's what makes this guitar so great, is that it sounds great with the stock pickup and everything. It seems to be staying in tune. I've used the whammy bar, haven't tuned it at all yet. So this guitar is just, it's gotta be the best bang for the buck, right? 179 bucks, that's about the price of most Squires out there. But you get a guitar that honestly plays amazing and can easily be gigged and looks great as well. It's sounding great on clean tone, sounds great on 6505. Just so you guys know, we're Pre-gain all the way up, low is about 9 out of 10, mid is about 4 out of 10, high is about 6 out of 10, post-gain is about 6 out of 10. All right, so I guess let's try out more of a super clean tone, which I think we're gonna use the Fender Twin. Let's see how this sounds. Like. <laughs> So yeah, that pretty much wraps up for the video. This guitar is a literal beast. And if you are looking to get it, I totally suggest that you do. Because this thing is well worth the money. And I couldn't be more happier. Thank you so much, Courtney, if you're watching this video, for getting me this guitar. It is absolutely amazing, and I appreciate it so much. But yeah, if you guys are on a low budget or just looking to get in the guitar, I totally recommend getting this thing because it is just so good. 179 bucks, you can't go wrong, especially for right out of the box. If you don't want to get it set up or something professionally and spend the extra money for that then you don't even have to worry because it sets up pretty well out of the box. And overall, this thing is just a great guitar. So yeah, if you guys have any more questions on the guitar or anything you want to know about it or whatever, leave a comment down below. I'm sure I'll do many more videos on this guitar in the future. Also, if you're new to the channel and you like what you saw, make sure you hit the subscribe button. It really helps me out. But yeah, that about wraps up today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed so much. This is the Kramer Beretta Special. 
the ultimate cheap guitar for the best price and all that stuff. Thank you for watching. This is Nate. Till next time, peace out.